Olympics as, as a kid was always a dream to me. I mean, that was the ultimate goal. To be here in Athens, uh, we had to come to the Olympic pool. And to be here with uh, four times Olympic champion Greg Luganus, it's a great honor. The main difference between uh, high diving and Olympic diving uh, is the entry. Because it's all the same mechanics. You know, the difference is you're, in one you're landing on head first, in the other you're landing feet first. Um, we do the same dives, only where the Olympic divers would see the water and grab their hands, uh, we as high divers see the water and we do a barani or uh, just place our feet down to the water and go in feet first. I don't think I can imagine diving 27 meters. I mean, that is insane to me. Well, initial thoughts is fear. Straight away, you, uh, you're not used to the height, so you look down at the water. <laughs> um, it's a, a calculated risk, um, but um, when everything goes well, uh, it's a great feeling. Arms up, keep your fingers crossed. <laughs> Yeah, I need to work on that running takeoff, so it's nice to have uh, the Olympic champion to show me how it's done. For me, you know, doing 10 meter platform workout and doing 50 dives, it was doable. At when I was in shape. <laughs> 50 dives in practice is just not possible in our sport. Between three and six dives um, is uh, kind of painful the next day. The thing is with a lot of the cliff divers, they may not have the opportunity to do the trick that they, they're prescribed to do until the day of the competition. So they have to trust their, their visualization and imagination to be able to be successful. We split up the dives in, uh, in two. Um, I practice my takeoff and the entry, both from the 10 meter. And when I get to the competitions, I put the two together. We've got people now doing incredibly difficult dives and dives that aren't possible from the 10 meter board. Um, so it really separates the sports and um, it makes this sport uh, unique and it's the only place that you can do these amounts of somersaults and twists. At least 10 years ago with high diving it was, you know, it, there were more trampolinas. Now, now high diving with the tricks that they're doing, I mean it's you know, they're tough competitors and doing very difficult tricks and, you know, a lot of them are based on, on uh, Olympic, you know, 10 meter diving. Okay, so now that was a workout for me, but that was just lead ups for you. <laughs> yeah. Right? Okay. Now let's go see where I train. Okay, deal. <laughs> uh,